Hi, this is Rob Hopkins, and I just wanted to share a little exciting moment, which is that uh, after working for two years uh, on a journey which many of you have followed through the blog that I've been doing and through social media and things, uh, the book that I've been working on, uh, which is now called From What Is to What If, Unleashing the Power of Imagination to Create the Future We Want, has now been sent to the publisher. The manuscript has arrived on their desk and now the editing begins in earnest but I just wanted to share this kind of a uh, what feels like a real landmark as a writer when you get to the stage where you can have a copy printed out that's been sent to the publisher. So you know in true transition style we can't let a moment like that pass without a bit of celebration. So uh, you know normally I might you know you might have had one of those little plastic firework things plastic. So I've torn up a few pages of sort of leftover uh, uh, paper and go, yay, fantastic. Uh, this is a very nice stage to have reached. So the book will be coming out sometime in the autumn and is being published by Chelsea Green Publishing, who are based in Vermont in the US. And there will be all kinds of stuff uh, that will happen when that happens. And uh, it's basically a book about imagination in terms of why is it that when we're faced with a challenge like climate change, which you could argue is the greatest failure of imagination in the history of our species, that when the IPCC tell us we need to see rapid, urgent and far-reaching changes to all aspects of society, we kind of go, rather than going, fantastic, brilliant, where well, we could put that over there and that over there and da 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 da, da. you know, why is it that our imaginations aren't a superpower at the very time when that's what we need them to be? And when our survival depends on us having a, a, a razor-sharp imagination. So it's an exploration of what's the state of health of our imagination, what ails it, and what could we do about it? We visit... Uh, city governments who are creating ministries of imagination. We visit all kinds of amazing projects where we start to get a taste of what it looks like when we really start to put the imagination back at the heart. And it was really fired by all the writers who I really respected, who I kept reading, saying, well, what we're seeing now is a failure of the imagination. But they never said, so why is that? What could we do about it? So that's where this book, From What Is to What If, comes from and I really hope you're going to enjoy it. There's now going to be a frantic period of editing and backwards and forwards but I just wanted to celebrate this moment with you all which is that finally uh, the first draft of From What Is To What If has gone to the publisher and I feel absolutely delighted. Thank you very much. Bye.